So every business has a marketing funnel. The marketing funnel works for your business because your business brings money and your marketing funnel knows exactly how this money go through so that they actually bam, hit your banking account. This video is about the principles of building the funnel. By the way, my name is Valerie. This is Dashley YouTube channel. And that's where we share a lot of information about marketing, sales, everything that's bringing money to your business. Let's start. So the very first thing you should know about your marketing funnel is uh, it is measurable. You can measure every activity that is made on every stage of the marketing funnel. So marketing funnel gives you analytics. Analytics is data. Data is figures and numbers. Plus every stage is going to be measured with the same unit. For example, if your marketing funnel is about the users, every stage is measured by users. If you are measuring your marketing funnel with money, definitely every stage is connected with money. So never mix different measures in one and the same funnel. Like, okay, we are going to measure the very first stage with the traffic, next stage with events, then we are going to measure the signups, then we are going to measure money. No, it doesn't work like this. So you measure everything with one measure. The second principle. Every stage is showing the progress of your marketing funnel, which means every next stage shows more involvement into your product. Like people are getting engaged, so they are not wondering about your website or your content. So these are not just uh, the activities people do. These are the activities that are connected with their interest to your product. So every next step is driving them to the purchase. For example, someone has watched a YouTube video and then landed a website of this company. Or a person has signed up and shared the information of their credit card. Or a person has chosen few of the items on your website and move to the checkout. What are the bad examples? A person has watched a video, then watched one more video and one more. So no progress. They are at one and the same stage here. Or a person has signed up and went back to your website. No progress at all. Or one more example, a person started the trial period and then started reading your blog. Again, no progress. Principle number three, the marketing funnel should be as detailed as possible. Land on the website, signed up and subscribed is not a detailed marketing funnel. What is a detailed marketing funnel? Let me give you an example. Signed up, went through onboarding tour, installed the script, paid for the service. Why is it important to make your marketing funnel as detailed as possible? For you to know exactly where people leave your marketing funnel. Like, okay, they sign up, they run through the onboarding and then they say goodbye. Was there something wrong during the onboarding period? Yeah, probably that's where you're going to work on during the next planning period. So if your marketing funnel is landing the website, signed up and subscribed, and you have the gap between signed up and subscribed, you know exactly what was happening between these two stages. That is why it is really important to make all the stages as detailed as possible so that you can analyze and act accordingly. Well, there are actually a few more principles how to build the funnel and you can grab them absolutely for free. Just follow the link in the description to this video and study the poster to be the master of building the funnels. Now, definitely you understand that this video is also a part of the funnel. And if you are watching this video for the very first time in your life and you're actually getting to know Dashley for the very first time in your life, then the marketing funnel would be the following. Like you watch the video, then you go to Dashly website, then you sign up, then you go through onboarding process, then you install Dashly on your website and you purchase Dashly to use it on your website. By the way, this marketing funnel may be even longer. If you don't take decisions quickly, then the marketing funnel would be the following. You watch this video on YouTube, 
Then you visit Dashly website. You share your email address with us and get emails from us. You read emails, then go back to the website, sign up in Dashly, go through onboarding, install the script on your website and purchase Dashly to use it. But what is the most important thing about marketing funnel? Marketing funnel is never your hallucination. It is what exactly people do on the website and then in your product. So once you build your marketing funnel, check what your users do on your website and inside your product. So these two funnels should be one and the same funnel actually. You can easily build the funnel using Dashly and seven days of free trial also give you this opportunity. So sign up, build the funnel and measure the efficiency of your business. Don't forget to check even more videos about marketing funnel on our channel and don't forget to subscribe not to miss new information about how you can boost your business. See you!